today I'm opening something very exciting. Very exciting. Tagline. Because everything's totally fine. You know, I gave you those cutters for a reason. Oh. Mm. I don't like them. That's what they're for. So, today I'm opening form. And as Isaac said seven times today, what is form? What is form? What is form? Form is an awesome company that makes awesome products, such as these beautiful goggles. And look, they're smart. Oh my god, this is so Apple-esque. Only one? Apple would have had two. Oh. Boring stuff. Boring <laughs> stuff? I mean, it's pretty boring. Wow. Very yeah. boring. Hey! Call it what it really is. Let's get you, you set up before coach. you swim. Scan the QR code to download the app. Follow the instructions. Go for a swim. I'll wow. be doing this in a few days, and I'll be filming myself. Cool. And it says, meet your underwater coach. Nice. Wow, cool little case. No excessive. The best is just ahead. No excessive packaging. Very cute and not excessive packaging. So, oh, this feels nice. It feels fancy. And this is very fancy. Whoa. Whoa, okay, so let's look inside here. Ooh. <laughs> they have different size nose, whatever these things are called, bridges? Yeah, it says right there, nose bridges. Wow, I'm smart, nose bridges. And it says, for a watertight seal, use the nose bridge that fits you best. And contact support to find the perfect fit. I need to do that. So Let's there's a screen out. inside it? I will get there. Take this out. Here's a charger for them. Such a cool case. Look, there's little little holes in here. Does this come out? Or does this stay in here? This comes out too. Because I don't want to be carrying all these bridges with me. Do I? Maybe I do. Once I find the perfect fit though, I can see myself taking this out, if it comes out. Now I really want to take it out. There. This come out, uh. see? Very good packaging. They yeah. could have put this in a separate box. I know some companies that would have, and wrapped these individually in plastic, but this is perfect. And look, there's different, like, there's arches. More of an arch, less of an arch. Do you see them sideways? Yes. That's really cool. Look at that. Nice. Because we all have different noses. Mm -hmm. And here... They are. This is the most like sci-fi thing I've ever unboxed. And I've unboxed some pretty crazy futuristic things like earplugs that are smart and watches, uh, rings that track your steps and all sorts of things. So, ooh. do not touch inside lens. Shall not touch inside lens. I'm pretty sure this will not come charged, but let's see. Here's the on button. Don't think it's on. So the idea is, I put these on, and I will see my laps and other information on the screen. So remember how uh, they talked a lot about Google goggles a while back, and it was mm. going to be the next big thing, and then like nothing happened, and they were banned, and people were kicked out of... Uh, Casinos. Well, this is that, but for swimming and legal. Maybe not legal in professional swimming. I have no idea. But basically, normally I swim and I track everything using my Apple Watch. And my Apple Watch does count laps, although not perfectly. So it'll be off a little bit sometimes. And um, also, if you have an Apple Watch, you know this, but when you have the water mode on, or if it automatically locks when it touches water, you have to like tap it a lot to open it, and you like to unlock it, you have to like do this whole thing. It's really frustrating, and if your fingers are wet at all, you can't touch the screen. So it's a minor inconvenience, but these are going to be a lot better for tracking laps. And you see them on your eye without having to be like, ooh, ooh, they'll be right in my eye. That's very crazy. What I don't understand is how it's going to look because, well, because it's just really bizarre. I never had anything appear on my lens before. So I'm gonna charge like an these. Oculus. 
and I will try and show you. I wonder if you'll be able to see it by... Oh. Can you look here. Can you go come closer and look? Yeah, there's a little mini screen. It looks like there's like a reflector too on the right. So. I'm curious if it's only, I guess it's only going to be in this eye. Yeah. I just, I have no idea. I looked into this a long time ago. Finally decided to get it. And now we'll, this is how it charges by the way, look. Hmm. So very strong magnet. I have a lot of chargers like this, like for my smart water bottle. That reminds me to drink. And I still ignore it. Um, and that, like, it comes off really easily. Like, the dogs knock into it and it falls over. This is really secure. So I'm going to charge this, and then you'll see me again, and you'll see some numbers in my eyeballs. But really lame numbers, so I'm not going to be swimming. We'll save that to Friday. So see you soon, and I'll show you how this looks. Hello, everyone. Is everything fine? Everything's fine. Everything's fine. Uh-huh. Hi. It's fine. Millie was uh, begging to come up here, and now she's not so sure. Yeah, go come up here. Come up here. Dips. Here. You don't have scissors. No. Oh. No, that's not what they're for. Okay, you're not unboxing a Millie. So, today I'm opening something very exciting. Very exciting. Tagline. Because everything is totally fine. You know, I gave you those cutters for a reason. Oh. Mm. I don't like them. That's what they're for. Smiley's looking for a cat. Come on. Creatures. So many creatures. Excuse me. All distracting creatures. This is Olena. And I'm Isaac. We're, we're moving, moving to Hawaii. Hawaii! But first... We're driving from New York City to Seattle. With Smiley, our nine-year-old rescue pity. In our Tesla Model 3, equipped for camping. And we are funding this trip with our Etsy store. Meaning we are bringing around 50,000 earrings. And 500 envelopes. And our label printer. On this 11-day cross-country road trip. Subscribe to the Travel Bug Bite today! If you liked our video, don't forget to click the like button, leave a comment, and subscribe. Check out our videos from all around the world and let us know what you'd like to see next. Thanks for watching!